It is not just people displaced by floodwaters in the aftermath of Hurricane Harvey. Dogs need help too. News Channel 5's John Cole Newland explains tonight how these furry friends are now being cared for in the mid-state. This is Dylan. He is a blind dog. He's also one of about 40 rescue dogs from southern Louisiana who made their way to Middle Tennessee yesterday. And thanks to the volunteers here in Middle Tennessee, he and the 40 other dogs are getting the help they need. At the Animal House Vet Clinic, it's all hands on deck. From their basement to the top floor and every room in between, each crate is full. Every one of these dogs was displaced by Harvey. We eventually got the call that they needed help in southwest Louisiana, getting dogs out to make room for dogs coming in. The big fluffy dog rescue sent volunteers down south to pick up the pack, 40 dogs in all. Getting back, however, was a bit of a challenge as remnants of Harvey hit Middle Tennessee. So those folks were on the road for 24 straight hours. I had drivers on the road coming in on 40. They got stranded in high water on 40, had to come around the back way. All the while, staff members here waited to help. God love them, Animal House came in and we had staff here at 3 o'clock in the morning to unload, so we're still triaging dogs. Today, volunteers are arriving in groups to do what they can. So they made a post about it and said, we need help walkers to volunteer. And I said, we should totally do it in the rain. Like we've been in the rain all day yesterday. We love it. We went out to the bars last night in our <laughs> bathing suits. Brianna Milley and her friends are vacationing in Nashville from Boston. They jumped on the opportunity to lend a hand. How often do you go on vacation and there's a natural disaster and you can go and help out? With a little help and some extra love. These dogs may find a forever home here soon. I'm truly blessed that this many people care about 40 dogs from Louisiana. In Nashville, Jonquil Newland, News Channel 5. It will be a few weeks before the dogs are available for adoption. You can find a link to the Big Dog or Big Fluffy Dog Rescue on our website, newschannel5.com. The Animal Rescue Corps is also doing what it can to help. Today, that agency transporting about 150 dogs and cats to their Lebanon facility from shelters in Texas.